Hello guys, <coughs> welcome back to another video. This is how to um, keep your valuables safe. In here, I've um, I've made a combination lock. It's really simple to do. Um, but like um, my one is this. That one's on. And that one's one, I think. Yeah, it was the outside ones in the middle one. The door opens. If any of the other ones go down though, it closes. So, open, close. And it opens and closes instantly, well, almost instantly. Okay, I'm going to show you how to do this. Okay, so, the lever. Oh, okay, this is a pretty cool concept, and it's really simple. You could have it for an adventure map, it would be great for an adventure map or anything. Um, what I've done for my one. You can do this multiple ways. If you turn this one on, if you turn that one on, um, th it turns the redstone torch off, which turns that off, which stops the um, signal from getting out. So if I'll show you quickly, I'll just turn the this one on and this one on. Okay it's still blocking it because that one's still on if you turn say the one there on it turns that on which creates a double negative which I just did the redstone so it goes under the door I'll, sh I'll show you that now uh, yeah it turns there it's a really simple concept but I hope I hope you guys enjoy stuff like this because oh, I'm gonna have to break the door I think yeah uh, break the door. So the door was resting on top of that block, which was that. It was actually a door turned sideways. So if there's power to it, it closes. It's pretty clever. Um, it's one of Seth Wing's concepts, like the one in his map, which is cool. So anyway, um, that's on. So that um, it's a negative. So it stops that it goes there and stops that from being on which turns that off which turns that one on I'll show you the other oh, I'll show you another possibility I'll show you how to turn the red sun signal oh you can have like maybe all of them down or half of them down half of them up so that turns the signal off which opens the door it's kind of confusing. So basically, it's opposites. So um, anyway, guys, here's the redstone. It's really simple. You can make it like 500 block, like a massive wall covered in levers. Half of them um, are like that. Half of them are like um, do that. Like it's you could do it so many different ways. So if you don't want someone to pull that lever, say, you could have it wired up there and, well, yeah, so you have to, if it was like a maze thing, you had to find levers, you could make it so you walk, you walk in, you find however many, like, you find, like, randomly scattered levers, you assume you have to turn them all on, you turn them all on, um, the door is still closed, you're like, what? you go through turn like maybe a few like one off or something it opens it'll be kind of confusing but it's a cool concept oh yeah you could have like riddles and stuff huh, that would actually be quite cool okay anyway guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this tutorial on how to make a safe lock you can make the whole thing covered in the, uh, the whole wall obsidian you can make everything obsidian and like um the reason I did this is because uh, you could do it kind of a hallway and you could block this off so no one can see it because that was um thing so you could block this off so no one would see it but it's still there it's a pretty clever concept but anyway guys thanks for watching hope you enjoyed um, um if I can uh, I hope I'll be able to do a few more tutorials like redstone tutorials because I love doing this sort of stuff anyway guys Thanks for watching. Peace out. Hello again, guys. Um, and this is a pretty cool way you'd be able to make a little 
thing. You you'd um obviously cover all that up uh, if you're doing a, making an adventure map. Okay, you open that. Blah blah blah. Walk in. This is diamonds in here above the door. Walk in. Open the chest. Diamonds. If if there's like an angry mob or something coming to get you, walk up, pull the lever, it closes the door, you're safe. How this works is wait, I'll I'll be I'll just be right up to the redstone when you get back. And I'm back guys. That's where the lever is. Um the lever you pull the lever, it lights up this it, which causes that to turn off which opens the door well which closes the door if you pull that it closes the door the door's open at the moment because everything's off so that's on but if I, for example i turned the lever on um that oh uh, the red the redstone there will would travel down there turn that off go down there open or oh, close the door so any like if there's an angry mob of people that you're stealing their diamonds or something, um, uh, and they had a s combination like that, and or if you wanted a safe house, you um, you type in a combination, whatever. You go in, you pull a lever, the combination doesn't work anymore. It's pretty clever. Thanks for watching. Please, um, if you enjoyed the video, please like. Um, th this is a really cool um way of setting up maybe a trap or whatever else. It couldn't, it may, it doesn't have to trigger a door. You could pull a combination. It like does some mechanical thing. It pulls down that block, pushes in a diamond block. You'll be like mine, and you like, ah, and then the will blow up or something. That should be pretty cool. Okay, anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Peace out.